Hello and welcome to Whiteboard Weekly number 27. Today we're talking about repurposing video content. So here at Coconut, we repurpose Whiteboard Weekly. It's our main video show that we put together and we repurpose that in different ways. So repurposing basically means we take this main Whiteboard Weekly video and then we turn it into other bits of marketing content. So firstly, we take the main video, we turn it into shorter videos, so you may see shorter videos on places like Instagram where it's like 10, 20 second segments where it's a particularly good clip of the video and we share that out uh, on a social media platform that uses sort of shorter videos. Then we take the transcript of the video and turn it into a blog, so repurpose that, so we sort of take what's written and then turn it into something that makes more sense when you read it out. So a blog that we put on the website, and then we take the audio from this and put it as a podcast. So usually these videos last anywhere between two to five minutes, and that's a really good short little audio uh, snippet to, to listen to on the podcast. So you can go and listen to that now, have a little listen. Um, so that's a great way of using sort of one video and turning it into lots of different bits of marketing content. So how do I do this for myself, I hear you ask. So let's take a conference, a franchise conference, and think about all the bits of content we can get from that and then turn it into other bits of marketing content throughout the year. So obviously, as I said in the last episode of Whiteboard Weekly, you can get loads of franchisee testimonials. So you've got all your franchisees in one place, you've got about 10 questions you can ask them, you can use those as one whole video where they answer the 10 questions or get them to cut those 10 questions into 10 separate videos. So say if you've got 10 franchisees answering 10 questions each, you've got those 10 videos, then you've got 10 other little videos within those videos. So 110 videos overall from just interviewing 10 people. That's not bad. And then you've got interviews with key staff. So they can talk about the support that they offer, what their typical day is like, what the franchise is like, why people should join the franchise. There's loads of questions you can ask them. So say if you've got five staff answering five questions, you've got those five questions as one videos, and then five individual questions as well. The franchise or themselves, they can answer various questions about what they do on a day-to-day. -day. They talk about why they set up the franchise, what it's like, uh, what they're looking for in a franchisee. There's loads of questions you can ask them. So say if you ask the franchise or 10 questions, one or two people as the franchise or answering 10 questions, 10 videos plus that one big video, 11 videos, yeah, from that. Uh, and then the conference overview itself. So sort of take clips from all these people talking, clips from the conference itself, people talking during the conference, you can make a really good solid conference video that you can use to advertise the franchise itself, the conference for next year. You can use that bit of content to promote loads of different things throughout the year. So if you go to one conference, there are literally hundreds of videos that you can make and that's just videos. Then you can turn that into blogs, articles that you can post across social media from all these interviews and then maybe audio content from snippets of people that you're talking to throughout the conference. So from one conference, there is literally hundreds of bits of content you can get just from interviewing people that are all there anyway. So why not do it? If you've got any other questions about video or franchise recruitment marketing in general, feel free to ask us in the comments below and uh, see you next time in episode 28 of Whiteboard Weekly. See ya.